Welcome to the Pikachu Adventure Club. Isn't this a pretty city? It does look lovely. I wonder where we are. Isn't Kanazawa a great place? We're in Kanazawa. Kanazawa is a city with a long history, located along the Sea of Japan coast in Ishikawa Prefecture. Pikachu, do you want to take a break? Pika! <laughs> Pikachu is taking its time to enjoy this beautiful city. Here you are. <gasps> Looks yummy. That cake does look yummy. What's the matter, Pikachu? Oh, are you hungry, Pikachu? Have some. That makes sense. Pika. That's not it? Pika. Huh. Oh, Pikachu. I bet you're thirsty. Ah, maybe. That's not it either? What could it be? Oh, Pikachu. Are you interested in this tea bowl and plate? Pika. I can see that. The tea bowl and plate are both very pretty. Pikachu, did you know that this bowl and plate are made from clay and wood? Oh, I have an idea. There's an exhibition here in Kanazawa that's full of Pokemon made from all kinds of things. Wow, what an exhibition. Sound fun? Then let's go visit. Sounds like a plan. All right, get ready and let's go. So off we go to an exhibition of Pokemon made from many different materials. From cool Pokemon to cute Pokemon, there'll be all kinds. You might be surprised to find out what some of them are made of. I wonder what we'll find. Are you excited? But first, we need to get there. Hey, what's up? Oh, wow. It's a Pikachu in a kimono. Isn't that cute? It must have come to welcome us. Hmm? Hello, Pikachu. You'll get to meet so many different Pokemon at this special exhibition. I hope you're excited. Did she say many different Pokemon? Pikachu. Which Pokemon will we get to meet? I can't wait to find out. Huh? Where are we? Pikachu, this is an art museum called the National Crafts Museum. Pika! Let's start the tour upstairs. Pikachu. Sounds good. Pika. Let's go. Pikachu! Look at all these displays. Pika, Pika. Pikachu, this is a vase covered in many Pokemon. Pika. Pikachu. I see an Alolan Executor, an Altaria, and many others. Pika, Pika. That was interesting. I wonder what other works they have. Pika? Pika, Pika. Pikachu, what are you looking at? Oh, it's a butterfly drinking water out of the ground. Pikachu, Pika. you must really like this Pokemon. Pika. It's definitely Pika. cute. Pika. Then I have a question. B? The colors of this butterfly were created without paint. How did this butterfly get its colors? That's a tough question. So we need to think of a way to create colors without using any paint. Hmm, is there a way to do that? The answer is by using wood of different colors. Look! Pika. This butterfly was made by putting together different pieces of wood, like a jigsaw puzzle. Pika. Wow! I had no idea wood came in so many different colors. Did you, Pikachu? For some pieces, the wood was carved so thinly that even light could go through. That's what they did for the butterfly's wings. What do you think, Pikachu? Color me impressed. Great, right? Next, we're going to go see a Jolteon. A Jolteon? 
What kind of Jolteon will we get to see? A Vaporeon, an Eevee, a Jolteon, and a Flareon. They look pretty impressive, don't they? Just look at this Jolteon. It looks so tough and so cool. Pikachu, you're not jealous, are you? Pikachu, there's nothing to worry about. You're all so cool. Aww, Pikachu's feeling a little bashful. Pikachu, I have another question. Except for its eyes, this Jolteon is made from a certain kind of material. What material is it? Let's think about this. We already know that this Jolteon looks pretty tough, so... Did you figure it out, Pikachu? The answer is... Metal! Have you ever heard of copper? Copper is a type of metal that's sometimes used in making coins. So this Jolteon is made from the same thing as coins? Copper was used to make the Jolteon's fur, but it was covered with gold and silver. Only the tongue wasn't covered, as you can see from its coppery red color. She's right! It's the exact same color! What do you think, Pikachu? If you look closely, you can see that each strand of fur is designed in the shape of a lightning bolt. No wonder this Jolteon looks so cool! Well, we sure loved that Jolteon! Now, which Pokémon will we see next? Let's see… Where are we now? Look! That lady's waving at us! Pikachu, here's the next room! Wait, Pikachu! Aren't you forgetting something? That's right! Thank her for the tour! Here's the next room! Hmm… There's lots of interesting stuff here, too! Look at this, Pikachu. What is it? It looks familiar. If you look closely, you might find Squirtle on that tea box. Squirtle? Let's see. She's right. You can see Squirtle. You'll find three Pokemon here, one on each side of the tea box. Wow, that's pretty cool. See how pretty and glittery these Pokémon look? Pikachu, now I'm going to ask you a question. Another question? This glittery tea box is made of something that all of you have probably seen before. Do you know what it is? Now let's think. It's something we've seen before, and it's pretty and glittery. Could it be a jewel? It also looks a bit translucent, like it's glass. What do you think it is? Any idea, Pikachu? Pikachu! The answer is... Seashells! Seashells? Some seashells are glittery, aren't they? I wonder how they're used in this tea box. This artist cuts the shiny parts of seashells into all kinds of shapes and then pastes them on his work. See how glittery those patterns are, even on a black tea box? Pikachu! Next, we'll get to see a certain move. A certain move? Hmm, I wonder which one it is. What are these blocks? They have a soft glow that looks very pretty. Pikachu, doesn't looking at all these blocks remind you of Icicle Crash? She's right! They do look like icicles! Pikachu, don't worry. Pika? These icicles aren't going to come crashing down. Pika. Pika, Pika. You can take a closer look at them if you'd like. Pika. Pika. Wow! It looks just like real ice. It's time for another question. What do you think these icicles are made of? Time to put on your thinking caps. Some parts are translucent. But some parts look cloudy. What do you think it is? The answer is glass. These icicles are made from the same glass as the drinking glasses you have at home. But when you polish glass in different ways, 
you can create all kinds of different looks. That explains it. But you know, whether the blocks are translucent or cloudy, they all look so pretty. Next, we're going to see a series of Pokemon combined with something people use every day. Pokemon combined with something people use every day? It looks like we're in a new room. Pikachu, this is it. The series. What are they? Wow, would you look at that. Pokemon combined with vases. Pika! Pika, Pika. It's a Vulpix. How cute. Pikachu. This must be a Charmander. And finally, Pika. it's a Charizard. What an amazing piece. Pikachu. Pikachu, these pieces are known as ceramics, and they're made in exactly the same way as tea bowls. Pika. Wow, the same way as tea bowls? Now then, what do you think ceramics are made of? A new question. Now, let's think. Actually, this is a question many of you might already know the answer to. What about you, Pikachu? Do you know? The answer is clay. Pika? Ceramics are made by baking clay at a very high temperature. Pika, Pika? That tea bowl we saw earlier was also made this way. Pika? When baked at a high temperature, clay becomes hard. It can hold water, tea, and other liquids without dripping. Pika, Pika! You can form clay into many shapes, color it with a special kind of paint, and even cover it with designs. Pika! You might even find some ceramics in your home. Ask someone at home to help you find them. That's a great idea. If you're interested, this exhibition has even more displays that combine Pokemon and all kinds of materials in fun ways. Yeah, we'd love to see more. Did you have fun, Pikachu? It must have been fun meeting all those Pokemon. Today, you got to see many Pokemon made of all kinds of materials. Some materials were glittery, and some made the Pokemon look very cool. I hope you found a Pokemon that you really loved. Look around and you'll discover all kinds of things that are pretty or even amazing. So keep an eye out for these special things, okay? You got it. Thank you for coming today, Pikachu. Pika! Pika, Pika! Good luck with all your other adventures. Pika! Thank you. And now, bye bye! A big thank you to the staff of the National Crafts Museum. Pika, 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 Pikachu, 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 Pika, 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 Pikachu, Pika.